All right, everyone. I wanted to switch gears here and uh, just share a little bit of something that I've talked about in several videos in the past with you guys. I've talked about the fact that I'm a, a big movie buff and I've made videos and films and shorts, short films and videos in, in one feature in my life up until this point. And I don't know, it occurred to me that like if I was watching my videos not being me and <clears throat> this bloke on the on the videos every now and then keep saying that they've made short films and videos I'd be like <clears throat> prove it you know or let's see some of this crap <laughs> so I'm like whether that's the case with you guys or not I'm gonna show you some of what I've uh, you know what I've done starting with this video here now this video um, is something that me and a friend pretty much my best friend at the time did when we were both uh, 15 the summer of 1992 and me and him were, you know, huge, and I still am. I don't really know him anymore. But we were, and I still am, a huge fan of just, like, exploitation, you know, horror, you know. I don't really like gore anymore, but when I was a teenager, it was kind of like, you know, horror movies were about kills and the interesting and gnarly <clears throat> way that people can be offed and, and this and that. And um, so this particular short is was actually shot with a Fisher-Price PXL 2000 video camera, which is something that Fisher-Price made, I think, in the late 80s. Um, just because, <clears throat> you know, my parents couldn't necessarily afford an actual full-size VHS, you know, video camera at the time. I got this, and this thing was, you know, Fisher-Price saved my ass because I was able to, you know, express myself and, you know, indulge in the art of... Uh, "Quote unquote art in this case of uh, of filmmaking or video making and it, you know even with a Fisher Price camera you can still hone your skills and develop your skills and try your hand at making movies." So long story short, this is a movie basically inspired by the movie "Don't Go in the Woods," which none of you probably have heard of, which is a horror independent <clears throat> horror movie made I think in 1981, which is basically just about people going into the woods and getting offed, you know, getting killed. And this movie is, you know, this short that me and a, I mean, that my friend at the time did is very influenced by Don't Go in the Woods, where it's just, you know, as, as gore buffs, we just want to explore what we can do at, at 15 years old with, uh, with some um, <clears throat> using motor, motor oil as blood, except for the one case where my buddy had it in his mouth was fake blood. And just seeing what we can do to do, you know, do our own kills and stuff. And my friend had this interest. He had this, he had this costume which was like this monk or whatever the hell kind of costume, a hooded costume. And he was all into this, like, I don't know. So you have this character. What I love about this is it's just completely utter nonsense. Like, just nonsensical nonsense me and him he had spent the night and we hadn't slept all night so a lot of this nonsensicalness is due to the fact that you know me and him hadn't even slept the night before he came over to sleep over but we didn't sleep he just stayed over and this is the next day when we hadn't had any sleep and we're just like you can see my energy level is so low I'm really I gotta cut off and, and show you and show it but uh <clears throat> it's just I love I love it you know obviously this is not high art by any means but it's a couple of a 15 year old experimenting with you know film in this case video production and I hope you guys enjoy it, it I, I will say that it does have some pretty impressive gore so if you guys are squeamish you might not want to watch it it's got some pretty impressive gore for a couple 15 year olds with some motor oil so I hope you guys enjoy it I hope you watch it all the way through this is um, basically untitled it's just a horror movie short that me and my best friend at the time made when we were 16, so uh, or 15. I, I always want to say 16 when we were 15. So uh, enjoy. Oh. Are you sure this is the right trail? I don't know. I thought you knew where that trail was going. We just had the place was down this way, and then all of a sudden. Man, 
and there's a, I don't know, there's something weird about this place. Yeah? A real creepy. Creepy? Yeah. But, uh... Ah! Ah! He's got someone around. Oh! oh. We got gas. Oh! Oh my god, my whole body feels... Hey! My whole body feels... Blah! Oh. Ah!
nice treat. <laughs> How'd you like my story? That was a pretty good one. Thanks. Yeah, but I have a story of my own. <laughs>